I just need, I know that I'm not gonna be able to beat him this time. Uh-oh, really? Missing? Is that how you're gonna play this? Is that really what you want? Is that your intention, your goals, your physique? Not your physique, but like your mind physique? You know, like brain food? I don't know what I'm talking about. Guys, let's just do this. Listen here, Steven. You're going down. You're going down like you're King Kong at the top of the Empire State Building. And I'm the goddamn airplanes, you know? It's me flying up there around you. You're swatting at me. You're holding Fay Ray or whatever. And you're gonna drop her, but I don't think you do. Maybe you set her down. I don't remember. I watched that movie like several months ago. Maybe a year. Time flies. So that's the story. I'm gonna heal myself. Um, I promised to do it in the last episode, and I'm a man of my word. Just like the Joker from The Dark Knight. He never lies. He never once lies in that movie. That's a thing that everybody forgets. Boy, <laughs> I feel like I've been recording for hours, and I've literally done one episode so far, so... It's gonna be a good session, I can tell. Do like that that beeping's out of the way, though. Boom! Okay, we're back in it, baby! Baby, we're back in it! So, if I, I, I was reading about, I wasn't reading about, let's, let's rewind actually. So I just recently watched the Pirates of the Caribbean movies, or the Pirates of the Caribbean movies, uh, which I think are really good, even though they're not. I think they're a lot of fun. I enjoy them a lot. I, I, I have a lot of fun watching those movies. And it really made me like get into pirate stuff. And so I was trying to find, he used toxic, but it missed. Maybe he, if he uses Toxic again, then that means he's out of Seal Wings, probably. Let's see. Spikes! Okay, I think I'm already spiked. That's okay, that doesn't hurt me right now. That's a later hurt. He might be running out of helpful moves for him. Let's see, he's using Spikes again! Oh, I think he's out of all of his moves. So I wanted to play a pirate video game on this show, but I couldn't think of any except for one, Sea of Thieves. I know there's this Assassin's Creed out that is piratey, but I've never played any of those, so I don't know. But I didn't, I, I, I don't know anything about Sea of Thieves. I've heard it's pretty device, divisive. I think some people love it, some people hate it. Uh, I'm interested in it though, and I've never seen it, or I've never played it, anything like that. So I definitely want to on this channel, but I don't think it's out yet. I think it actually comes out like earlier this week that you're seeing this. It's already out, maybe, based on something that I saw on the Steam page. And I might be wrong about that, but I'm not going to be able to play it until my next recording session, which is on Monday. Which, if you're watching this, it's Friday, a couple days from now. And then the next first episode of that won't come out until Tuesday. I don't know how much of this you care about, but the point is, that's going to be the next series that I play. I'm excited about it. There it is. There's the full restore. But here's why that's not a problem. He's used all of his good moves. This is evident by the fact that he keeps using Spike, which means I should use this opportunity to heal myself. And I haven't been, and that's dumb. Okay, all right, we're gonna deal, do that. I'm gonna revive all my deceased Pokemons, uh, particularly Wurmples two, four, and six. I don't know why I said particularly when that's the only Pokemons that I can revive. Those are the only ones that fainted. I don't know how many spikes he has, but he's not using Struggle yet, which is great news for me. I really hope that he just keeps using spikes. Although, does that stack? If he uses spikes, let's see. He uses spikes, but it failed, okay. I wonder, because he definitely had used spikes and then used it again, and the second time, and third time even, it laid the spikes down as if he had used the move successfully. That makes me question if that move stacks, and so any Pokemon that goes out is going to have extra damage done to them. I hope not! I hope that's not the case. Fortunately, it might just well be the case. We don't know. We literally have no idea. It's not failing. I mean, it is failing now, so that's a problem. Now we're up to Hyper Potions, and we only have 11 of them. By the way, all of this is predicated on the fact that I only know what his first Pokemon is, and it's a problem. Skarmory's are an issue, so... I, I, I have no idea what's coming next. He could have... What, what would be bad? What would be bad for me? It would be... An Aaron would be bad? Anything... I, I, I've talked before about a Ghost Steel-type. If there's a... I don't think there is one, but if there is, or at least in this gen, I don't think there is. If there is, then that would be a Pokemon that I literally wouldn't be able to hit at all because my Tackle is a Normal-type move and Ghosts don't get hit by those. And Poison Sting is a Poison-type move and Steel-types don't get hit by those. Hence, Skarmory is such a problem. Uh, any kind of, like, any kind of high defense, like a Ground-type, anything that is resistant to my Tackles is a problem. 
because then I can only do the poison stings. And if I can't do the poison stings, oh boy. Such a skarmory. Yeah, steel types are among the worst things to have to fight for the Wormple Challenge. I, uh, I'm not envious of myself, that's for sure. Anyway, lingering plot threads of things that I've been talking about in this episode, but maybe don't remember. See, I don't remember them. I believe all my Pokemon are fully healed now. Let's take a look. It's in a book. Reading friggin' Rainbow, that's what I say. All right, it's time to just tackle. Uh, I believe So his full restore does not restore his speed, which means I'm still going first. And it also doesn't restore his PP uh, for his Pokemon moves. So I'm still good there. Everything's golden, dog. I'm, I'm set as a fiddle. A thing people say. Eventually he is going to use struggle, though, and I hope, I hope upon hope that it's not a very, uh, it doesn't do much damage to me. I don't know the rules of struggle. I don't know if it's a set amount of damage, like Dragon Rage is, or if it's, you know, a percentage, or maybe it's just based off the attack. Maybe it's like a 30 attack power, something like that. I, I honestly don't know. I know it's not as strong as Aerial Ace. I hope so. Oh, there it is. Okay, struggle. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Not too bad. Oh, and he's hit with recoil, which might do more damage than my tackle does. Let's see. I wasn't paying attention. Let's watch. Let's find out. Use a struggle. Boom. Hits himself. And then, oh, okay. So it's about the same. So he's still doing more damage to me than I'm doing to him, but I have a ton of hyper potions. I don't have a ton of hyper potions. I have some hyper potions. Definitely, assuming that his other Pokemon are just as strong, if not more so, than Skarmory, I'm absolutely going to have to get money and buy more items because I sunk them all doing this. I believe I have some PP restorers, so I'm not worried about that. I think if I get out of those, if I run out of PP, if I see I have six tackle left, tackles, uh, I have a ton of poison sinks because I'm not using them. I have a ton of string shot because I'm not using them. It's just tackle that I have to worry about. And I can switch to another Pokemon too. So I'm not worried about running out of tackles. That's not, that's not an issue. My issue is the supplies. Whoa, a critical hit. Yeesh. I'm not crazy about this. I wish that it hadn't happened just now. It's a hyper potion. I have a full restore, and that'll give me more health. This is not going to give me a full health, but it gives me close enough. He's not going to, even if he does another critical hit, I still have plenty of time to respond before. Yeah. So we're, we're, we're fine. We're all good with this. I just need, I know that I'm not going to be able to beat him this time. Uh oh. Really? Missing? Is that how you're gonna play this? Is that really what you want? Is that your intention, your goals, your physique? Not your physique, but like your mind physique? You know, like brain food? I don't know what I'm talking about. Guys, let's just do this. It's just so, it's just you just doing the same thing over and over again, you know what I mean? You're just tackling. You're just tackling, you're like a football player. Just tackling, day in and day out. I'm gonna get a friggin' concussion over here. My Warp of 5, now he's just missing all the time. It's probably the concussion I mentioned earlier. Remember earlier when I mentioned the concussion? This is that. You need to take yourself a nice rest, Wurmple. Well, actually, wait. That's probably a bad thing to do when you have a concussion. I don't know anything about concussions, okay? All I did was watch that movie. No, I didn't actually see it, but I saw the trailer, and that was enough. Will Smith. Football. Okay, so maybe you guys can help me out with something. I told you, you guys know, you guys are very intimately familiar with the fact that I'm a huge Pokemon fan. Hence all this. And in so being as forth that, I have been playing Pokemon Gold version. Nope. Pokemon Silver version. Nope. Pokemon Crystal version. That's it. Generation 2, Crystal version. I've been playing it, and I have an ever never-ending never quest to catch all 251 Pokemon in that game. I've been trying to do this for years. I keep mentioning it on the show. I finally decided to jump back into it and try it out because I had some time on my hands. And I, I, I understood that it's going to be difficult because what I did with Worm what I did with Generation 1 is... I'm going to use a healer thing for my, for my uh, PP. Okay, Max Elixir? I don't know about Max Elixir. That only does 10. That does only does 10. Maybe I do need a Max Elixir. I only have one, though. Huh. Oh, fully restores the PP of a select of a selected move. That's probably the best thing to do is max ether. That gives me the most bang for the most buck. There we go, tackle. Okay. So <clears throat> that's what I did with generation one is there are cheats you can do where you go and you look 
at a character, and then you fly away, and then you store a value in your thing, and then you go back to that character, and then when you fight him, it'll instead be the Pokemon that you're trying to catch, and then you can catch it. Fine, you can use that chick trick over and over again to catch all the Pokemon to your heart's content, and it's great. But Generation 2 is different, and I have not yet found a cheat for that game to catch every, every single Pokemon. Now, if you guys know of a cheat for that game to help me do that, let me know. But I do want to try to do it legitimately with the tools that the game offers. So one thing that they made is Pokemon Bank. And this is a system that you can subscribe to, and it will allow you to transfer your Pokemon from your games on a Nintendo 3DS or what have you, and transfer them out into the Pokemon Bank and then you can get them back later, transfer them across games, that kind of thing, as long as they exist in the game that you're trying to transfer them from or to or whatever. The problem is that you can only transfer out of Generation 2 on the Virtual Console for 3DS, but I think you can't transfer into it, which means things like uh, uh, Machamp I couldn't be able to get because I could transfer out Machoke or Machop or whatever, Machoke, but I couldn't get Machamp out. Assuming, I don't even know if that works with the evolution. I don't know if they evolve in doing the Pokemon Bank. I don't know anything about it. I just heard about it, signed up for it, tried to use it and couldn't. But it's still worth worthwhile because I'm going to use it for the other Pokemon generations later on. That's all in the future. Right now, I'm just worried about Gen 2. So let me know if there's something that I should be aware of. I don't think you can use Pokemon Bank with Gen 2. I don't think you can do any cheats with Gen 2. What do you guys think? What do you know? If worse comes to worse, I'll just have to buy another 3DS and, uh, friggin' do that. We're about to beat Skarmory. He has not used another, um, what do you call it? Full Restore or anything like that? And it seems like he would have by now if he was going to, so I don't think he will. So, I'm gonna end the episode here. I know it's a tease, but I think it's for the best. I'm gonna end it here, and in the next episode, we'll beat Skarmory and see what he has next. I believe all of our Pokemon are doing pretty well right now. Actually, what I should, well, I was going to say I should send out Warble 3, but I guess I could always do that between the next Pokemons, because when they say, would you like to switch Pokemon, I can say yes. All right, well, there's nothing more for it. Uh, in the next episode, we are going to destroy ourselves a Skarmory. It will be so delicious. This has been an historic battle, and I'm sure the rest of his six Pokemon, his five others that he has, are going to be fine. Right. So we'll see you then, everybody, in two days, and we will get there. It'll be Sunday. Maybe that is good. Maybe Sunday will be a good day for you. Who knows? All right. Hope to see you again. Bye, everyone.